If you're standing up, you might want to sit down because this is going to knock some daylights out of you. Drop a thumbs up. Look what we're saying. These pyramids right here in Nevada. Look at this. It's a cover up. It is a cover up. Bro, look. Bro, look. This pyramids right this right here in Nevada. I'm telling you, bro. It's a cover up. This land, bro, our people, bro. They don't want us to know who we is. They don't want us to know where we come from. They don't want us to know our heritage because it connects us to our land rights. You can destroy graves. You can destroy land titles and names, but you cannot erase these pyramids. They stand forever. The question will have to be asked, how did they get here? Damn. What's that? A person to sleeping? Me, they look like a giant sleeping. Yeah. Sleeping giant. But there were no such thing as giants, right? What are those? Because they're like fingers. They're like some fingers or some toes. Holy. Maybe I'm just tripping, right? Rock formation or face? Yo, bro, that looks like the, a kid is sucking on a, on a titty out here. Like, bruh. You for real, right? Like, rock formation or a baby face. Yeah, 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 yeah. Maybe I'm just tripping, right? Nah, you're not tripping, bro. I see that. That looking like a reptilian. Or something. Or maybe you're but tripping. damn sure don't look like it's just a mountain. But maybe I'm tripping, right? Yeah. <laughs> this one kind of messed up, because whatever happened to these giants, and they must wanted to get a hug, kiss off before it was over, because that's what it looked like to me. Like, well, damn. Maybe I'm tripping. Yeah, maybe you're tripping. That elephant? looking like an elephant. That looking like a horse. Yeah. That look Megalodon? Like shark? Or, or turtle face? Like a lizard or dinosaur oh, or some shit. Yeah, okay, yeah, you can technically say lizard too. Nah, ain't no damn way you gonna tell me there ain't no alligator or a crocodile or some shit. Yeah. Look, 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 look at that. Nah, I see you, bro. I see you. Come on, man. <laughs> so that's supposed to be a mountain, right? Now I see what he's saying. Th that's uh, not a tree stump. That's a mountain. Damn! I believe what you want, though. Okay, damn! So we discover, like... A magnetic portal at horseshoe bend. I don't know, like, uh... Look, look at her. Like, it's... But damn, she cute, though, bro. Like, she, she kind of... Bruh! You know what I'm saying? I'm like, electrifying. Look at my mom's. <laughs> bruh. Okay, there is and a weird fact then, with this. There's a weird fact. Whenever your hair strikes up like that, you should not be out, is what I heard. I could be wrong. Like, electricity probably gonna okay. strike. There are chances, some like that, I think. Is what I heard. No way. A magnetic portal at Horseshoe Bend. So when she puts a finger, it almost feels so fake, though. Do it again? Farther? It's okay. Yeah, bring the finger. Yeah, the hair stands up after. Hey! <laughs> My god, that feels so CGI though. The government hollowed out mountains in Denver. No, no, no. We're gonna talk about this. I went to Colorado Springs, Colorado about a couple months ago with some, some people. Mm. And the guide, we went on like a electric bike ride through the mountains and he told us, the guide literally told us, yeah, that mountain right there, they hollowed it out and put like a whole, they hollowed it out and put stuff in it. And I, that, that, that perplexed me the, the entire rest of the trip. Because I was randomly sitting there thinking like, y'all, they said they hollowed out a mountain. They hollowed out a mountain. Is this? I was like, is this mountain real? Is this a real mountain? And nobody, yeah, nobody yeah, was yeah. perplexed like me because I was like, what's it? Why are we hollowing yeah. out mountains? She asking questions. She asking questions. Mountains. The fact that our government can even do that. Oh, you would be. And you would be surprised what they are doing it and what they've done in the past. You would be surprised. Welcome to planet Earth. Let's get some. So yay sound effects in the background. Welcome to planet Earth. And this was at near the Denver airport. Do it that what you will. Denver, holy. Yeah. I believe the Y Files recently made a video on the Denver. I'm gonna have to yeah, upload a video on that too soon. So definitely subscribe if you're new guys. Hit the bell. You still thinks it's a game. The underground city is real. 
there's no way they don't have something underground, right? There are a lot of, uh, they have underground now, bunkers this is said for, to be in Odessa. They have underground bunkers for all the elites, right? So if there's like a nuclear strike, oops, we launch a nuclear, oops, we launch another one, oops, the world is now gone. But before it's gone, uh, they have underground, very luxury, might as well add here, luxurious underground bunkers where they can just sit there, stand there, do helicopters with their release for days, if not months, with all the food, the best food, and, and everything with, with like high quality stuff, uh, luxury items in there too, to keep them entertained as well. Yeah, man, it is, it is, it is kind of scary. It is kind of scary. So, in Ukraine, some are speculating that it might be from. World War II, when Ukraine was controlled by the Soviets. However, we know Ukraine was named the human trafficking capital of Europe what? in 2016. You can look Lord. that up. Holy! Many, many undocumented children and stray children are living in Ukraine. Now, many of these bones appear to be from adults. But no they way. appear to be picked clean. You can even see tooth marks inside of some of them. This isn't normal. This wasn't a... So is that a catacomb? Is that what it is? Mud flood. Some of the bones are even stacked in meticulous ways. This is definitely some sort of creature or maybe a culture of some sort that... Let's oh face it, God. eats people. And that's what this looks like. Let me know what you Holy. guys think in the comments. Holy. There's just so much of that. Oh my god. Damn, man. That is creepy. At the end, guys, we're all going the same way, man. We're all going the same way. America, which I got so to I say. To make a pot roast. Are we and as I pulled it what? out the slope. What that look like? Pay attention. Bro, what is that? What's that? Bro, that's a nipple, bro. Bro! It ain't a cow a nip, nipple. Man. It ain't a pig yeah, nipple. Yeah, they feed me. What's up, people? Come on, y'all. Tried to get me to eat some woman titty. The movie Cloud Atlas showed how women were cattle being fed to each other. Kind of like how some farmers do pigs and chickens here on this planet. My guy, you really had to pull that to de demonstrate that? Like, like I, I gotta. Bruh. bruh. Bry you out real quick, like... Believe what you want, but that video does pose a question. What is the supplement meat that we are eating in these chickens and porks True. and cows? Because there's literally not enough on this planet to feed the human race. I don't know about this one. I believe there is enough. There is more than enough on the planet, but it's an interesting topic. It's an interesting question because, yeah, man, there is... Yeah, when I mean the fact the fact here is that they already are uh, they have three D printers for three D printing meats and shiza like that. It's always better to just not do fast foods. I get you hear that all the time. Don't eat fast food. Don't eat fast food. You do not know what they have, and it's good advice. It's just bad for your health, and you do not know what's inside. So that's yeah, that's a, a w w uh, w question for sure. At the rate that we are eating all of these things. Who can make it make sense? And are we ready for the truth? I'm about to fucking throw up. I haven't even got on the dark web yet. I'm going to try to access. Make sure you screenshot the next post. Holy sick, because I have nothing else to lose at this point. But somebody sent me what they already found. Okay, let's analyze this. Netflix inside job. Okay, so PMO not even five minutes in and this Shiza, I cannot say that word on YouTube. This is why I say it in German. Uh, this Shiza is just blowing the cover right off. Everything is hidden in plain sight in movie shows, even music, uh, music, music videos. If I'm not mistaken, okay, I'm not, let me know when you're watching this video, uh, like what day, maybe you're watching this in the future. But recently we heard, I'm in Canada, I don't fi follow politics, just want to say this, uh, if I'm not uh, for or against him. But recently, uh, Trump got indicted. I believe that's the, the correct term so uh and, and uh, what's the that cartoon name simpson i believe that's what it is they predicted that a long long time ago actually so it, it's kind of freak it's kind of like how because simpson is known to have predicted a lot of stuff they have predicted a lot of stuff that have came true 
How is that possible? Yeah, once or twice, maybe three times. Okay, let's just say ten times. It has been more than ten times, okay? More than so many times. Whatever, whatever they predicted, they have... Yeah, yeah, it's it's just one of those WTF moments. Ah, I love being right. Human meat project, people for people, one body can feed up to 40 people. Bro, no way this is a real website. Huh? Okay, so you are re got to be, you gotta be kidding me, bro. They have this website and there are people face showing up. Like, these are the employees running the project. Like, come on, man. Go ahead and look it up. This is why I kept talking because I knew that with the more people I reach, the more people will come forward with information. I'm going to give you guys the browser to the dark web. Be very careful, like. Be, do all of your research before trying to access it because I don't want them getting anybody's information but I'm just going to give it to you if you're curious. When they're feeding the dead to the living, you know the end is near. Check out this death chamber, this washing machine. They call it aquamation, where they liquefy the dead what? and then dump the remains down the drain to be recycled into the municipal water supply. And no so people way. are drinking it they're showering in it, they're doing their laundry in it, and this is happening in most states across the country. In most major cities, they're recycling dead people and feeding it to the living. Okay, hold up, hold up. What's the source? What's the source of this? I need to, I need to Google this. Uh... What does that mean exactly? And they're grinding up the bones into powder. They call this calcium phosphate, which is going to be used for food processing undoubtedly maybe in your vitamins what and so what are the implications when people start eating dead people like cannibalism guys uh okay let's check this out where's my obs okay let me put it here okay put my face cam on the other side of the 258 sample sizes clear lab says that human dna was found in one vegetarian burger and red dna was found in a fast food burger okay i'm not surprised about fast food though uh i believe that there were a lot of instances a lot of cases where i heard stories like that back in the days too so yeah okay i'm not surprised about fast food but he said like vitamins and water too right a vegetarian burger and ground meat sample while unpleasant it's important okay what while unpleasant yeah i mean yeah it's important to note that it is unlikely that human DNA or red DNA is harmful to consumer health. Hey, yo! What the actual... Okay, water. Water. Human DNA from blood is detectable for up to 11 days in environmental water. STR profiles are recurrent. I mean, if this is information is kind of like on Google, I don't know. Is there DNA in the ocean? Google is not going to tell you everything, right? Uh, okay. A human DNA found in vitamins. That's the thing he said, right? Vi uh, vitamins. Vitamin over 200 genes. Our DNA are and identify over 200 genes. Yeah, I don't think Google... If it's true, I don't think Google will tell you that. But if it's not true, I hope it's not true. Thoughts, guys? This is creepy, bro. This is wild. Is there going to be Kuru running around out there? Mad cow disease. What about in a spiritual sense? What is that like when you're eating and drinking dead people? Of course, they're spraying this on the food supply. Irrigation. They're using dead people as compost, and people are drinking it. So what does that mean? What does that feel like, ladies and gentlemen? Obviously, this is another satanic ritual. That's being... I don't know, man. Th this is a massive claim. This is a massive claim, but I'm not surprised to hear. And I wouldn't be surprised if this is true, though. Yeah, damn, man. That is freaky, bro. That is freaky. I'm not, uh, not even a single bit shocked about human DNA being found in terms of, like, fast food restaurants. That I'm not at all. But in water and vitamin, a little bit. 
a little bit shocked, a little bit shocked, pretends to be shocked, I guess. But I wouldn't be surprised if that is true. I hope it's not. I hope this is just uh, for entertainment he's doing. But it doesn't feel that way. Thoughts, guys? Performed before our very eyes. And essentially people are being raped by this death juice as they're forced to drink it. Talk about drinking the Kool-Aid. Now they're drinking dead people in the major cities. That's why they're all crazy in these big cities. Holy. They're drinking dead people. And they don't even know it for the most part. And they keep finding human DNA in the food supply. What do you think that's all about? Yeah, it's probably okay. not just aquamation, but they're probably grinding babies and who knows what else in Damn. these meat processing plants so that people will eat human flesh without even knowing it. That's how these cult members get their kicks, ladies and gentlemen, quite literally. So Aquamation has been around for about 10 years now and it's spread to nearly every state and every major city because they're running out of space they say in the cemeteries they just can't build a new one outside of town so they're gonna liquefy man the 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 way things are going here in the west the west is done man like there's so much this, okay this is just one thing he's talking about but i'm pretty sure you can start to imagine and things gonna pile up right like that's wrong this wrong that wrong like things used to be different back in the days man it's uh it's getting now obviously time changes i'm not saying that things will not be different things needs to be different they need to be better for sure but the these things are completely going in another direction bro completely and it's like the movie the matrix how long before people end up in pods like this connected to the matrix i don't know about that bro like that is some freaky stuff bro. holy did wait what you're saying that he got that from the trash oh my god man this is just <laughs> this is insane this is insane bro like Real mermaids caught on camera. Oh my goodness, man. Real mermaids caught on. Yeah, man, I don't trust, bro. I barely eat outside. I don't want I'm gonna try and avoid that as much as possible. The following footage was recovered bro. after attaching a GoPro to a shark. Y'all believe in the mermaids? Or, <laughs> or what? Let me know, man. Do you believe in mermaids? I don't know about I don't know about that. I'm not saying it's not real. I'm not saying it's real, okay? I don't know simply. Wait, what? Oh no way, no way, man. No way. This is okay, please, please, sweet baby Jesus. Uh, here's the thing, right? You hear this all the time, or maybe you don't, but if you never heard it, you're about to actually hear about it. Because I heard this thing, and it sounds like it sounds just crazy. I feel like that that's way too out there, but I wouldn't be surprised if certain amount of birds are government projects, surveillance, like a UAV. If you play Call of Duty, if you know, if you know what I mean. Let me play this sound effect. Oh, oh, yeah, uh, basically the the thing is that birds are government experiments, and, and birds are flying around just to kind of keep an eye out on eye, eye out on us. I don't believe that. That's com to me that sounds, you know, what I'm saying, <laughs> you know, what I'm saying I don't believe that, but. I'm, I'm certain they probably would have made certain drones that look like birds and if you look at it you're just not gonna be able to distinguish or un unless you really have a good eye and you have spent time and you had maybe uh, uh, parrots or not parrots like birds as uh, as pets can can you make birds as pet I don't know sounds doesn't sound natural but some people do own birds right so it, yeah, maybe then you can make a difference. You can, but, 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 but yeah, yeah, thoughts? Or maybe they capture some birds and do some weird stuff to them and and if somebody actually captures them and they do what this gentleman just did and they find that weird stuff out, could be, right? Cameras everywhere. Oh, the TVs at Walmart have them, them too? That's why they cheap. Yeah, guys, this is exactly why. True, 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 true. Hey, 
that I understand that, you know, they can see us through With these Wi-Fi? right here if we cover them up, you know, so and so. Yep, yep, yep. We can see we also have one in the front. Okay, that's the phone though. You know, I'm yep, gonna yep. ask what happened to the phone. Yeah, it fell, cracked, you know, and I decided to play operation. <laughs> well, okay, maybe he's gonna find something. Yeah, I'm not laughing. You can on tell him, back here it does not have nothing. This is just for your speakers and for your um, mic. Right here for your mic. But what's interesting is I actually opened it up, opened it up, and there's a fucking camera. Where? A camera. Here? Oh, snap. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Okay, so there's like another camera. That's like the hidden camera. You can't see it. Oh my goodness. I mean, I'm not surprised. Yeah, right okay, so they have that circle here so it can like look through, but on the other side, you won't be able to see. Holy. This is why like whenever I'm changing uh and stuff, like I so basically th this is where the normal camera is like in the middle, right? Here. And this is where he says this is inside like right here. So whenever I'm changing like I pull I put that under my pillow completely. I don't trust this Shiza, bro. I don't trust us and do the same guys like if you're changing you do not want your bobs leaking out I mean you don't want your schlong leaking out. I, I mean we all have the same hardware uh, Kind of it's nothing special. I have a schlong somebody else have a schlong. It's almost kind of like the same Okay, the only differences could be in the inches and the length and whatnot, you know what I'm saying, but still it's yours My hardware is my hardware. Okay. I don't want that leaking out. It, that, that makes sense, but crazy Crazy, absolutely wild. I know I'm making it gives it enough jokes of the situation, but but absolutely wild. So it doesn't matter if you cover up the ones in the front and in the back. They're yeah. still watching. Watching the news and this happened. And let's start off with a check of your next weather with meteorologist Alyssa Carlson. She joins us live in the studio. Alyssa, this really is the calm before the storm. Yeah. What? Oh. You know, we're gonna go ahead and go to break right now. Yeah wake up i need you to open your eyes wake the fuck up bro look at this shit Yo. you would really believe that we look out for you while we bankers and brokers are only a few but if you saw that you'd take back the power hence daily terrors to make you all cower the panics the crashes the wars and the illness that keep you from finding your spiritual wholeness. We rig the game and we buy out both sides to keep you enslaved in your pitiful lives. So, go out and work as your body clock fades. And when it's all over, a few years from the grave, you'll look back on all this and just then you'll see that your life was nothing. A mere fantasy. Man, do you think our government gives a fuck about us? They do. Yeah, that that should make you think for sure, hundred uh, percent. Like, uh, we we know they don't care. Like, how many we are ever like what seven, almost eight billion? Ah, they don't care, bro. They don't care. Not, bro. They do not. Okay, look. Here's another one. They sent sixty-eight billion dollars to Ukraine. Ukraine. And then United States of America just hit our fucking debt ceiling. That's gonna hurt the fucking pockets of all the Americans. Bro, they don't give a fuck about us. They never did. They never did, bro. This is fucking crazy. Yeah. Guys, click on this video on the screen. Yeah, if you wanna go down this rabbit hole, you may as well do it now before it's too late. Check these videos out, guys. They don't want you seeing that. And I will see you right there.